Hi, this is Bill Doley, President and CEO of Archaeology Southwest, where we explore and protect the places of the past. I'd like to share how your support helped us achieve our mission in 2013. We've been refining how we invest our time and dollars in our core activities, outreach, research, and site protection. Together, these are the foundation of our holistic, conservation-based approach, which we call preservation archaeology. We're committed to meaningful public outreach. Sharing discoveries about people of the past engages people of today in efforts to protect the places and objects that help to tell those stories. In March of 2013, we co-hosted an archaeology roadshow at the Casa Malpais Museum in Springerville, Arizona, with partial funding from the Arizona Humanities Council. Area residents came to learn more about artifacts collected by their families or found on their property. We talked about the histories, meanings, and archaeological values of the objects, rather than their monetary value. We also recorded where objects had been found, adding to the archaeological knowledge base for the region. The information exchange was important, but so was the goodwill and trust that was built. Community members have since made five major donations to the Casa Malpais Museum. Today, many research questions don't need to be answered with a shovel. There is an enormous body of data waiting to be examined or re-examined using new techniques. 2013 saw the culmination of our Southwest Social Networks project, a multi-year effort undertaken with the University of Arizona and funded by the National Science Foundation. The project used analytical techniques based in network theory and geographic information systems, or GIS, to examine changes through time in how southwestern communities interacted with each other. The team used four million data points about ancient sites and artifacts. None of the information came from new excavation. It came from archival, museum, and field reconnaissance studies. We shared our findings in our magazine and in other academic publications where we hope it inspires others to take on big questions without shovels. As our supporters, you share our belief that many places of the past deserve protection. Being prepared is key to achieving that goal. We've developed a planning process that identifies which places are most important to protect and what protection strategies we should use. We meet with many interested groups to determine how to respectfully safeguard places that matter. By the end of 2013, we had completed eight separate planning efforts and defined 242 priority areas. Now we're reaching out to help landowners and land managers understand and protect archeological remains in these areas. All of us at Archaeology Southwest offer our sincere thanks for your support. I hope you share our pride in these accomplishments and the many other projects and programs you make possible.